Hey everyone, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com and we're going to be taking a look at the Progressive Dynamics Mighty Mini AC-DC panel, converter, and smart charger. So as the name suggests, this is going to give us a lot of different functions in one unit, but still keep a relatively low profile. So you can use this in an RV, a camper, or even a tiny house. And the main thing about it is that it allows you to convert your AC to DC panel and vice versa. Uh, AC to DC power and vice versa. That's really important so that you don't waste any of your power whenever you're connected to shore power on uh, your DC items, things like your fans, your smaller lights, and other sort of accessories like that. Pulling power from the batteries, it's going to convert your AC or shore power or plug-in power to DC so you can still use all those other accessories. Also, Whenever you are running off of your batteries, it's going to help you to do it more efficiently and make sure that those batteries are fully charged whenever you get to a spot where you really need them. The way it does that is by using a smart charger, so that's going to vary the voltage based on the particular needs of your battery at the time. So if it's really depleted, it's going to ramp up the charge. Uh, once it's sitting pretty much close to fully charged, it kind of floats at a certain level and then it'll uh, ramp up every so often to cycle through and make sure that there's no stratification for your battery. That's really important for lead batteries or lead acid batteries, but it also can work with lithium batteries as well. They require a little bit different kind of charging cycle and typically a higher output of voltage, so this is able to handle that as well. You can switch it from one to the other pretty easily. Uh, so there's just a little switch on the inside here that's kind of the new update with the Mighty Mini is that you can use this one product for both types of batteries. So if we open up the panel, just pops up and open. So on the inside we'll have all our fuses here. This is going to be for our DC connections to make sure that everything is fuse protected. The few up here, these are going to be for reverse polarity protection. So if you happen to switch the positive and negatives on your batteries, this protects the system from getting overloaded. And then our switch for changing things over is going to be kind of hard to see, but if we take this panel off, you can pull it up from the top. There are a couple little tabs that hold that in place. We can get access to it. So pull up one side and then the other. And now in here, we'll have our tab right on the side. So it's going to be really hard for you to see. I'll try to zoom in here so you can get a better look at it. But it's just gonna be this little bitty switch that goes from LI to LA. LA is for lead acid, LI is for lithium. So you just have to flip that little switch to get it to change. LI is on the top and LA is on the bottom. It's, on, it's kind of turned to the side, so it might be a little bit hard to read. But right now it's set for lead acid. So if we turn it up, it's gonna be at lithium. So pretty easy to switch it from one to the other. You wanna make sure that nothing's connected whenever you make that switch. But again, you do have the option of using this with both types of batteries or other types of batteries. This will work with, uh, in addition to lead acid, it also works with AGC, gel, and flooded lead acid batteries. All in all, I think this is a really smart system. It definitely allows you to have a lot of flexibility with your power connections. It keeps it all in one area, so you don't have to worry about running things to multiple devices to keep everything connected. And it gives you that peace of mind that your batteries are going to be properly charged and ready to go whenever you're off the grid. That's pretty much all there is to it for our look at the Mighty Mini. If you want to see the whole list of specs, you can check out our website, eTrailer.com, and look up the part number. It will give you a complete list of specs. This particular model does work uh, or is rated for 60 amps. There are a couple other versions with different amp ratings, but this is kind of that middle of the road. Um, unit. There are also bigger units that can handle a little bit bigger or uh, more power. So if you want to check those out, those are also available here at eTrailer.com. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.